Wow. So when you talk about entrap entrapment, all right, basically it's common law in origin. So you don't find it in our constitution. So when we say common law in origin, so the British brought the uh, principles here, you know? Concept. Yes. They ruled us, and uh, the principles as they have developed there, the case law, they used to apply here directly. Until finally, we passed the Judicature Act, 1873 or so, to say that the common law that they developed did not apply automatically here. So now, what happens is that if you bring a case on entrapment from the UK or any other foreign country, it's mm -hmm. for the judge in Ghana to look at it and decide whether it applies, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, so, and so far, we've accepted a number of uh, cases, done a number of cases where we said there wasn't entrapment. Let's use the same ANAS. Mm -hmm. See all the cases is done, number 12, the Biscuits case, so many of them, so, 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 so many. Mm -hmm. So the entrapment, as uh, uh, Sami Dako uh, sort to uh, explain, basically, if you already have a predisposition to doing something, and then the investigator comes and offers you an opportunity to commit the crime, it's not, he's not entrapped you. You're already on your own course. You already had those proclivities. You already tended towards it. You already bent mm. towards the crime. So it's your bending towards the crime. That, right from the animals. Yes, <laughs> that is what brought or drew the investigator. So you see, uh, as I mean, that was a kind of predication. Yeah, so the, the if journalist just doesn't get up and randomly goes to anybody. No, mm -hmm. there, there should have been a controversy around you. That's the uh, target, you see. So when that happens, you already have developed, you've already set or uh, by yourself a certain course of conduct mm -hmm. that seems to say that you want or you are interested in that crime and he comes and he makes it easier for you. It's not entrapment. So entrapment is very difficult to uh, prove, uh, extremely. You remember Nyantichi and his coefficient and it's interesting, just a comment. I was wondering why Nyantichi follow, followed Mr. Japan to the uh, court. Eh? It's like they now want to pay an ass back. No. Well, he's been like, talking. What uh, Honorable Aqua said, we have to protect investigative journalists at all costs. We have to protect them because this is our society. The rot is too much. If we kill off Anas, Manasseh and Co, we are doomed. Uh, you know, nowadays I like to refer to Plato's Republic when you read it. And the reason, I hope in future we'll get more time to go into the genesis and the foundations of this our democracy. Mm -hmm. When you read the Republic, you see as uh, 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 Plato, he is recounting conversations of Socrates. Talk about the society, people taking advantage of the town, the society. It's too much. It's sickening. It's sickening. It's just, just too much. And you could see it in the jubilation that greeted the judgment. It's like the crooked ones had now had a field day. They're jubilating all over that, yes, this guy should be clipped. That's just it. And it's too much. Look, so we'll have to, you know, kind of sit up. Beyond Anase and Manase, we should, the strong people in our society should be looking at cultivating more journalists, more gen investigative journalists. Otherwise, we are doomed, though. Because, Alfred, if not, when Manase, Anase, and Co., and the one who did the, uh, this, uh, the one that led to the resignation of the Upper West Regional Minister. Um, uh, yeah. Uh -huh. the, the journalists who did it. Is this Selom or something? The journalists who, mm -hmm. those guys, I'm talking about all the investigative journalists. Mm -hmm. Edward Adetti and, uh -huh, and, Adetti and Co. If these guys stop working, we are doomed. Look, these crooked guys will come after all of us. They will just finish us in no time. So it's in all of us, our interest to continue to support Anas. By supporting Anas, we are supporting the whole of our society. Otherwise, we are finished. You see, our president, Kufado, is not interested in strengthening uh, transparency and issues in the public sector. I remember, I will always mention this thing the conduct of public officers bill. You see, because he's seeking to bring transparency so that assets will be declared and then the, the, the shroud will have more biting teeth. He says, no, 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 he's not interested. So that's the whole, uh, what do you call it, setting that people will push back. So this one fits into that kind of agenda. Let's clip people who want to strengthen society. The work these investigative journalists are doing, they are strengthening society.
So anybody who is not interested in strengthening society, we should see that as an enemy. That's There's great. an interesting point that uh, lawyer that you have made as well earlier, that, and I want you to also expand it, that the law favors the method employed in exposing crime or mm -hmm. corruption mm -hmm. or mm -hmm. any ills in society except for torture. Mm, torture and uh, the duress. You can employ yes. every other means to... Undue to, influence. Yeah, a number of them. And so, other, uh, on orthodox yes. means to expose yes. corruption or wrongs yes. in society. And the court will rely on it. Yes. And the court uh -huh. will not rely. Will not rely on torture and due influence. Yeah, and the that court is. will rely uh -huh. on it. Because we I don't see. want you to go that far. So you yes. see that entrapment. So from what lawyer the family report said, entrapment, then what happens is that, like you said, there's already controversy. So let's take which one? The number 12. Mm -hmm. So... Um, Anas knew that GFA was rotten. We all hear it. You see the coefficient Nyantichi talked about. We all knew that, look, GFA is rotten. We all know that football is full of ways and means. Uh, but we are a country where we like to cheat age, cheating, all those things. So we all know that, look, football was so, so, so rotten. So when he went in there, he didn't go to entrap anybody. We knew it openly. Ways and means. You have to buy referees and the rest. Ah, Nyantichi said that. How do you think we made it to the World Cup and the rest? Ah, so those things are out in the public there. So because of that conduct that we already in our GFA bent towards certain conducts that are not straight, when he went in there, he, wasn't, he didn't entrap anybody. The thing was already going on. Ah, but you hear referees who collect money and put it in their socks. All manner of things. Even when we're kids. It's been there for decades. Hmm. So you see, so that's the context. That, that is not entrapment. That is not entrapment. When you're already on a certain course and the journalist comes, so there's that predication, there's controversy around you, there's a public reputation that you are bad in this particular area, and he comes to check, to investigate, and it makes mm -hmm. it easier for you to uh, this, uh, commit that wrongful act. That's not entrapment. And he had what, and I want to support. You know, when Honorable Aqua was speaking, I was like, wow, for once I'd forgotten about party colors. He spoke for the nation. Yeah, uh, Mr. Okanse. Mm -hmm. What Honorable Akwa said, yeah, he spoke for the nation. But look, we must protect this investigative journalist. We must. We must. And you know, in order to get there, the ways, the methods that they use, it's not all of it that we understand. Corruption is not fought openly. Uh -huh, yes, Master, are you corrupt? No, that's not how it's fought. So the way these guys do, we don't understand very well. You ask Kofi Bwachi, you remember when he was in the service, people had problems with him. Ask him how he caught armed robbers. There are some of the things you have to play ball with them. You have to be involved even in the crime to a certain extent with them, right? That's how it is. So let's be careful. Just because you see, oh, they say he's taking uh, $75,000 to another person. Please, you heard Manasseh say, it's not conclusive. Mm -hmm. Let the case go on appeal. By, uh, yes, and let the court of appeal decide. And after that, we even have all the way to the Supreme Court. So that conversation will go on for long. But in the interim, what I'm bemoaning, and that's the same thing Honorable Aqua and Honorable Dafia Mekpo have said, is that, hey, this judgment tells you, the reactions, the jubilations tells you that our society is sick. Our society is really sick, way from the top to the bottom. Otherwise, you see, this judgment even tells you, otherwise, which country would you see that the president and finance minister are busy chopping money through data bank, and we are quiet? So, the larger what, majority, we are just bad people. That's what this what, judgment, what, what, the reaction is. also said that, you know, even if you employ the unorthodox means, yes. the ethics must apply. Mm -hmm. So that, I mean, and, and he, he, he was quite consistent in making mm -hmm. reference to, even in the realm of the employment of the unorthodox means of, of gathering information yeah. through journalism or mm -hmm. undercover journalism, mm -hmm. it does not relegate the importance and presence of the ethics that bounce the world? Oh, definitely. Oh, everything will require ethics. That's why Honorable Dafir Mekwe first told you, it's not every evidence the court accepts. There's undue influence. When you say undue influence, so like the knowledge gap, like between a priest, a pastor, and a congregant, lawyer and client. So lawyer knows the law. They use the law to, like we say in three, we bring the news to take the money. So you just say the professional and the lay person, banker, customer, you know, expand the relationship. So that one, the law presumes that if you do that and take property or something, you, there's a presumption that you, the, the expert, you are wrong. Of course, you can lead evidence to rebut it. 
Torture, we all know. So police will take you, beat you to confess, all those things. Duress, and her torture is a form of duress when you use force, etc. Okay. Yes. So we are saying that the ethics, by all means, should be, uh, what do you call it, respected. We should adhere to that. Otherwise, then it will lead to a Wild West kind of uh, situation, mm. right? Yeah, so we support that there should be ethics. But what we're saying is that in the meantime, you see, as I said, me not going into the judgment. No, 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 no. Do you also have challenges with the words and the, the, the expressions by the judge in this, in this ruling? Uh, of course, as for some of the words, they were a bit overboard, obviously, mm -hmm. considering that an, an nurse is now a cultural icon. Please, let's get this very clear. So those who were jubilating, I'm like, okay, it tells you that it's not every value you create in society that the whole society will accept. If you look at the number of years he's done this work and we've accepted all the work, we will also take it that we have a strong culture of what? Uh, investigative journalism mm -hmm. is part of our culture as Ghanaians. Yes, in fighting corruption. Because, and as Honorable Akwa stated it, you heard him say two presidents have lauded this Anas principle. President Mills and Ekufuado, except that Ekufuado is done a U10. But at least Are you sure? he, he's paid Are you sure? Oh, Ekufuado. He's certain. I remember NDA, NDA matter that people, he should <laughs> sack chief executive. Ekufuado couldn't sack. Even when the matter was in court, the man was going from his but office. But he's resigned. To court. Hey, it took so long. Ekufuado is so, so weak no. on corruption that he's so nauseating. No, 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 no. Very no. nauseating. <laughs> but at least he has paid lip service to the Anas principle. You remember his 18. Uh, very uh, notable quotes that I've read a number of times here. So what we are saying is that you see the Anas principle is now part of our culture. So it's too late in the day for somebody to kill it. Okay. Yes.